There are lots of ways to cook a meal. An oven, a stove, inside. Those are all great. But let's talk about something that's a lot more fun. Moving outside and doing a barbecue meal. How do you plan a menu for a summer barbecue? Now there's two types of barbecues I want to talk about. Something quick and fast for your family. This could be something like doing some chicken breast, doing some shish kebabs, a couple sides. Nothing better in the summer than grilled corn, maybe some coleslaw, maybe a baked potato. Really fabulous way to come home from work in less than an hour, put a really great meal on the table, not have to heat the house up with a stove, not have to get the oven going, but a really quick, delicious meal. Now, how do you plan a barbecue menu for a larger group? You know, if you're talking 15, 20, 25, even 100 people, there's two pieces of meat that we recommend. The first is a pork butt. The second is a brisket. It's a really affordable way to cook for a lot of people. You can take a brisket and probably cook for 20 people with one brisket. A pork butt, probably 15 people. Some great sides, coleslaw, beans. Again, corn is also really great in the summer. It's very quick. There's not a lot of prep. You just soak it in some water, throw it on the grill. 20 minutes later, you've got some great corn. The most important thing is to be creative, have some fun. You know, one of the things we like to suggest when doing a barbecue is for you to do the meat, but invite the people that are coming to bring their favorite side. This is gonna allow you to focus on the star of the, of the meal and allow your friends to bring the supporting cast, which is gonna save you a lot of time in the kitchen and at the grill. Have fun with it. There's lots of stuff you can do in planning a barbecue meal. It's really just up to your own imagination.